Sonntagmorgen. Ich bin immer noch ein bisschen verschlafen, kleine Augen. Immer noch ein bisschen müde, egal. Wie heißt es immer so schön, man soll damit weitermachen, wo man aufgehört hat. Und das ist in diesem Fall Beyond the Steel Sky. Wir haben es geschafft, gestern in Union City einzudringen. Und jetzt gucken wir mal, was uns da erwartet. Also, ich habe mich noch nicht getraut, zu weit wegzugehen irgendwie, aber naja. Wir sind auf jeden Fall jetzt drin. Ich hoffe ja, dass wir nicht gleich platt gemacht werden. Okay, Getränke ausgeben ist ja funktionieren. Ja. Ist da eigentlich jetzt immer Getränke bekommen? Okay, das wundert mich jetzt ein bisschen. Okay, dann müssen wir... Ich dachte, wir hätten das Ding schon gehackt. Henscan hat Nutzerrecht aus Benkels. Getränk ausgeben. Ja, ist angezeigt. Ablehnung abspielen. Vandalismus-Sensor. Ausführungsfahrt anhand des Bankerlinks. Äh, Limits des Nutzers wählen. Ablehnung abspielen. Wir testen das mal so. Ah, so geht's, okay. Auch komisch. So, eine Dosis Bankels. Können wir noch eine zweite nehmen? Hier oben eine zweite haben wir auch bekommen. Das ist schon mal sehr gut. Gucken wir hier nochmal kurz was, was noch schnelleres einstellen. So. Okay, toll. Wir haben schon mal einen Automaten gefunden. Scan a Handscanner, aber da passiert nichts. Welcome, Citizen Graham. Outdated U-Chip Firmware detected. Firmware must be updated to use Union City facilities. I was about to return to give Ember a piece of my mind when. Transporting you to the nearest safety services. Oha, jetzt kommen wir da an und was haben wir als erstes? Wir kommen gleich zum Sicherheitsdienst. Das wollte ich eigentlich vermeiden, aber das gehört wohl zum Game dazu. Das ist ja schlimmer als eine Achterbahn. Hm. Oh, die Kakadus sind doch überall. Mann, Mann, Mann. Alter, was für eine Aussicht, ey.
Na, die Typen sehen schon aus wie Cyberpunk, Leute. The stalkers had come into the city. But looking around, that didn't make any sense. This place was a paradise compared to the Union City I'd left all those years ago. Joey had certainly turned the place around. I had to find the stalkers. And whoever he was, Graham was my only lead. I just had to sort out my U-chip problems first. Okay, er löst es selber, alles klar. Hello. Good morning, Graham Grundy. I trust you are well on this fine day. Actually. Aha. Have you tried Dijon buttercream spangles? It's new. Sounds delightful. That's the spirit. Now, Mr. Grundy, we both know why you're here, don't we? Uh, I guess we do. Your firmware, it's ridiculously out of date. Let's get you sorted then, shall we? Go on, place your hand on the platform. Okay, here goes. No, we have no other choice. I ask not why. Well, that's very strange. Good day! What's very strange? What's very strange? You said that's very strange a moment ago. Something about my data. I didn't. You said what's very strange. I only said it because you said that's very strange. Problem in your ship. Great. What else can I do for you, Citizen Graham? There was something strange about the ID that I had acquired. While she may have lost the plot, I definitely hadn't. Listen, I don't know if you'll be able to help on this. I'm here to help. Okay. I'm looking for a child that went missing two days ago. And from which part of the city did this child go missing? He was from outside the city. I can only help you locate citizens. I'm looking for a vehicle. Well, a monopod station can be found at either end of the piazza. Are there any vehicles in the city that have legs? Polite request for disambiguation. By legs, do you mean a vehicle transporting prosthetics, flat-packed furniture, or fried chicken? I mean a vehicle with legs for propulsion. Do you mean a skateboard or scooter? You are no help. I'm here to help. Would you mind scanning my U-chip like you did before? But, Graham, your firmware is up to date. Humor me. Okay. Well, that's very strange. Okay. There, you just did it again. Because you asked me to humor you. I mean, you said that's very strange again. I assure you that I have a precise log of this entire conversation, and I said no such thing. It appeared that every time she tried to access my data, the last few seconds of her memory was wiped. Is there anything else I can help you with? No, just thank you. Was I helpful? Yes. Would you like to fill out a survey? Absolutely not. Okay then. Keep a smile on your face, Graham. Now that I dealt with my YouTube problem, I needed to find out more about my new identity, Graham Grundy. Union City wishes all citizens a happy aspiration. Schade, ich hätte ja gerne mal ein bisschen am Schiff rumgelötet, muss ich sagen. Die war ja ein bisschen seltsam. Aber da sieht man mal, wie manipulativ das System ist. Please dispense all waste. I'd never tell him, but Joey's statue looked magnificent. Also nach dem, was ich bis jetzt hier im Game gelernt habe, dürfte dieses Fahrzeug mit den, na, wie soll ich sagen, mit den vier Beinen hier eigentlich gar nicht existieren. Hey, got a minute? For you, sir? I have all day. What do you do here? My name is Hollow. And it is my pleasure to serve the wonderful people of Union City on this glorious Aspiration Day. And what are you serving? Well, social climbers can bring their Aspiration brooches to me. And then what? 
I use this machine here to customize the hologram projected on the brooch. Isn't that fun? It's a real parade. Ich muss sagen, der ist mir aber schon lieber als so ein Hologramm. Also dann lieber so, so, so ein Blechroboter. What can you tell me about the council? Nothing that you won't have heard already. However, if you take a look behind my stall, you can catch a great view of the Citadel. The Citadel? Where the council are based. It can be seen through the skyline right behind me. Have you heard anything about missing children? Oh my, that's above my pay grade. Are they social climbers? No. They were taken into the city from the gap. Well, I certainly wouldn't have had anything to do with that. What is an aspiration brooch? A special wearable reward to Union City's esteemed social climbers. Courtesy of the council. Yes, but what do they do? The brooch permits entry to areas around the city, exclusive to social climbers. Ah, Such das as the old einiges. history exhibit in the Museum of New History. It also tells your fellow citizens how great at gathering kudos you are. How can I get my hands on one of these brooches? You didn't receive one in the post? I don't think so. That's because aspiration brooches are only delivered to social climbers. You need an awful lot more kudos to be in with a shop. Maybe next month, eh? Sure. Or year, perhaps. So you change people's aspiration brooch? Only if they ask me to. Sure. How do you change it? First, my customer places their aspiration brooch here in the machine slot. Then, through me, they can choose which hologram they'd like the brooch to display. And you put it on the brooch? Now you're getting it. Sounds simple enough. <laughs> I'll see you later. I can't wait. Mm, okay. Calling all social climbers. Customize your aspiration. Museum für neue Geschichte hat derzeit nicht für Besucher geöffnet. Oh, schade. Das Museum war nicht offen. Ich muss später zurückkommen. Oh, Holo-Werbung. Kann ich auch manipulieren, oder? Die beiden hier austauschen, glaube ich. Ja. Gehen wir mal auf Anwenden. Hm. I was enjoying my time in the Piazza, but I doubted I'd learn much about Graham here. Ich kann immer nur die austauschen, glaube ich. Ja, die Bahn zum Beispiel könnte ich gar nicht austauschen. Ich kann immer nur die austauschen, die irgendeine Eigenschaft haben. Das würde auch gehen. Was dann passiert? Oh, der Bot.
Ah, jetzt verkrümelt er sich. Da kann man schon ein bisschen was manipulieren, das ist gar nicht verkehrt. So. Oh, hier laufen aber viele Menschen rum. Können wir uns mit allen unterhalten? Nee. Ach, Greta Terminal, da kommt sie wieder. It's most naja. excellent to see you again, Graham Grundy. The pleasure is all mine. How can I be of assistance today? Thank you. Au revoir. Now that I dealt with my U-chip problem, I needed to find out more about my Milo's trail was running cold. I needed to check out Graham's home. Ja, der verlangt aber Dinge hier. Hooray! Another customer. Please scan your U-chip to place an order. Mag anpassen, rot. Ich kann ja nur die beiden austauschen. No. One fresh premium spankles. Excuse me. Greeting, citizen. Have you come for another extra large fluoride orange spankles with extra foam? I don't know if that's my sort of thing. Incorrect. According to your order history, it is your new favorite beverage. My order history? Indeed, Citizen Graham. You love it. Do you know anything about missing children? Oh my. That's above my pay grade. Unless they came to this cafe. I doubt it. Nobody else seems to have heard anything. Excellent. I'm glad to find myself synchronized with local knowledge. Now, may I recommend you forget your troubles with a cold, crisp can of Spankles. What do you do here? My name is Barry, and it is my pleasure to serve fresh, crisp, premium Spankles to the wonderful people of Union City. Do you prepare the Spankles to order? No, sir. That would be unforgivably inefficient. I merely have to collect the flavor from the dispensary and... Voila! You sound an awful lot like that aspiration brooch droid. Hollow? I guess so. Are you the same model? Correct, sir. And how proud I am of that, too. Hollow is a fine droid. An honorable droid. You're a real fan, huh? No, sir. I'm a real droid. Any chance of a coffee? Spankles? No, no, a coffee. A cup of joe. Toffee-flavored Spankles? No, coffee. Coffee flavored caffeinated coffee. Coffee. I have no idea what you're saying right now. However, all ranges of Spankles include 250% of your recommended caffeine intake. What do you know about the hmm. council? The Democratic Party of nicht. Union City government, as introduced by Joey. His final gift to Union City was to transfer leadership to those most deserving. Can I get a can of Spankles? Yes, indeedy. There's one waiting for collection right in front of you. Right. Thanks. See you later. You feel a thirst to come in? You talk to me. Oh. Gonna mind coffee as pleasant as this place was, I doubted it was going to help me find Milo. Kann man hier irgendwas machen? Den 
Queen selber kann ich nichts mehr machen. Ah, was ist denn das hier? Da kann ich auch nichts machen. Hm. Türsystem Tür öffnen Begrüßung abspielen höflich warm Kann ich die austauschen hier Nee ich kann nur die Bahn hier austauschen ne? Die Bahn miteinander austauschen Und die beiden kann ich miteinander austauschen. Welcome, Citizen. Welcome, Citizen. nicht richtig zu sein. Das noch mal so. Welcome citizen. Ändert sich irgendwie nichts. So, hat der Nutzer das Recht auf Sprinkles? Geschmack anpassen, Orange, okay. Alarm ist deaktiviert. Vandalismus, höflich. One fresh premium spangles. As pleasant as this place was, I doubted it was going to help me find Milo. Ich denke mal, wir haben hier im Café genug geguckt. Wir kommen da auch nicht rein, also von daher. Verbindet mit Minos. Fotoarchiv, persönliche Daten. Das bringt mich nicht weiter. Kann ich auch nicht reden. Automat kann ich benutzen. Also verdossen werde ich hier nicht. Welt 
Wind aufwecken. Nee. Okay. Now that I'd resolved my outdated U-chip problem, it was time to look deeper into my alter ego, Graham. Pod has been requested. Please wait for embarkation. Sagen wir vor, da bist du da. Welcome, Citizen Graham. Where would you like to go? I knew Graham had some sort of connection to Milo's kidnapping. His home would be my best, in fact, my only lead. Take me to Graham, my home. Lakeview Apartments. Certainly, Citizen Graham. The city knew a lot more about Graham than I did. As I arrived masquerading as a dead man called Graham, I was apprehensive about what I would find. But I had no choice. I had to find the stalker. And whoever he was, Graham was my only lead. The seal on the floor showed my buddy Joey just as I remembered him when I left him in charge all those years ago. Jetzt bin ich zwar im Haus, aber ich muss wahrscheinlich auch erstmal rausfinden, wo ich überhaupt wohne, in welcher Wohnung, welcher Stock irgendwie. Hey. Hey, buddy, watch where you're standing. What's your problem? <laughs> your face for one. Excuse me. Well, if you hadn't been staring at the floor like a moron, you'd have seen me. Do you know a guy called Graham Grundy? Nope. Sounds like a moron. In that case, let me introduce myself. Graham Grundy. Doesn't surprise me. Do you know where I can find Joey? Oh, I don't know, weirdo. They say he walked into the gap, or sailed across the sea. Either way, he abandoned us all in this place. You don't like it here? Needs more color, wouldn't you agree? I didn't catch your name. I'm your mama! <laughs> Alter. What? Macht so Mutterwitze. Nee, nee, nee. Do you live here? Do I look like I live here? I'm not from around here. Maybe everyone here looks like you. Yeah, and what do I look like? Trouble. Keep walking. What happened after Joey left? Well, duh. Council runs the city now. I'll leave you to no. whatever it was you were doing. Die bringt uns oh, auch wieder nicht weiter. I miss you. Yes, I'm very busy. Hey, Dirtbag, what's your favorite color? Huh? You heard me. What's your favorite color? Red? Bold choice. Later, man purse. Later, uh, backpack. Ha! You got nothing. Clearly not everyone in Union City was quite as courteous as they were happy. Ich will nichts machen. It was another image of Joey. Just as I remembered him. Clearly he'd made his mark. Was ich krass finde, warum stellen sie ihn denn da mit einem Arm? Also. Oh, was wie schon wieder. Mal weg. Ich 
hoffe, die sind in dem sind schon so weit, dass man direkt dann in die Wohnung kommt. Seine eigene. Okay. Wait, I know that you chip. Oh my, is it really? Yes, it is. Alter, das Master Graham, you have returned. Master Graham, zu Jan wie C3PO. Good day, huh? I shall inform Madam and her guest that you have arrived. She will be so pleased. No, no, that won't be necessary. She will be overjoyed that you have finally returned to the bosom of the family. Oh, huh. My apologies for the interruption, Madam Songbird. It's Master Graham. What about him, Chipworth? It appears he has arrived home, Madam. Ah, I was hoping to meet you, Mr. Grundy. Mentor Alonzo, Ministry of Wellbeing. I was just here to investigate some irregularities. I'm sure my Graham needs a few moments to freshen up. Why don't I show you my Kudos records? I don't know who you are, but right now we're both in a lot of trouble. So for both our sakes, you'd better convince the Mentor that you're Graham. Um, yes, of course. I'll stall him. Just don't come through that door until you know enough about Graham to pass yourself off as him. Don't worry. You can count on me. I wasn't sure what I'd walked into. But if I was to convince anyone I was Graham, I needed to find out more about him. His job, his family, his state of mind. The mentor could ask me about anything. Information about Graham was scattered all over the place. All I had to do was look around. A shelf full of sports gear and awards from years gone by. Okay. Ist ja noch relativ einfach, das alles like so Graham and his wife on their wedding day. They look blissfully in love. Rhythmic Gymnastics, first place. Schlecht. Amethyst or purple glass? Either way, it looked expensive. Fairy tales, courtly romances, and art books. Wein. Union City Red. I suspected it was more fruit juice than wine. Definitely an improvement on the food dispensers they used to have here. Personally, I preferred an open fire for cooking. At least one person in the city appreciated a nice cup of coffee. Although I doubted Union City Blend contained even an ounce of actual coffee beans. Könnte ich einen Roboter haben? Heizungshöhe einstellen. Kann ich die miteinander austauschen? Geht nicht. Auch nicht. Nee. Okay, manche Dinge kann man halt nicht ändern. Geht auch nicht. Den Typen irgendwie nicht. Äh Excuse me, please. Ist schade, dass die Shipboard irgendwie nicht äh, behandeln kann. The trees in the gap weren't as pretty, but at least they were real. Thank you. 
Apartment Tür. I was hit by the acrid smell of chemicals. I wondered if Graham self-medicated. Giant scorpions in the sewers, real or fake? <laughs> Unlikely. The tentacle monsters would have eaten them years ago. Wer kann sich das alles merken? When I came to Union City 10 years ago, this was very much the case. These days, I wasn't so sure. Anti-Hobart propaganda. Some things never change. A printer? It was rare to see one of those. How to survive a war? Better just to not be around to see them. Immer nur wenn es rot leuchtet, ne, kann man das verändern. Drucker. Ne, auch nicht interessant. Espionage during the Hobart Wars. Nice to see the propaganda was still around. Couldn't access Graham's messages. I added that to my list of things to look into. The blind blocked out all the light from outside. Yeah. Developing fluid in trays. I hadn't seen gear like this since I was a child. A uniform like the one Graham's wife wore. It was cut for someone much larger. The logo on the uniform was quite distinct. Looked like these photos were taken by the city walls. It looked like one of the land trains from the city walls. It was a detailed model. A security forces copter. I still had nightmares about those things. Twice I'd flown in them, and both times they crashed. I hoped I wouldn't have to risk it a third time. Was was für ihn alles so normal ist hier? Also ich meine, ähm, an impressive <coughs> collection of medals ranging from bravery to long service. Was für uns normal ist, so meine ich back to before I was born. Das sind ja alles jetzt Antiquitäten irgendwie für uns sind alles so Sachen normal. A sword? Aber in der Zukunft Blade was braucht cracked. man zum Beispiel auch keinen Drucker mehr. Gespart Papier. I wondered if the people knew that Hobart agents had helped me save their city. A cavalcade of cryptids. Someone believed in monster stories. The box was for a deluxe hollow plinth replacement lens. There was nothing inside. Warum kann ich das Poster nicht sehen? Ah, jetzt. The droids who stare at goats. A classic. Wo ist noch was? Ach doch, das kennen wir schon. Okay. If I was going to pass myself off as Graham, I needed to know all about him. His work, his social standing and his health prior to his demise would be a good start. Perhaps I'd find more on his personal terminal. I needed to find out more information if I wanted to avoid getting caught out. Ich dachte, er hört gar nicht mehr auf zu reden. Äh, was ich krass finde, dass die Frau mit irgendeinem Politiker da im Schlafzimmer ist. Hm. Naja. 
sich auch halten von was man möchte, ne? Habe ich schon alles angeguckt? Pictures were all of Graham's wife. They were photochemical prints, taken using an old-style film camera. The retro technology had managed to blend songbirds seamlessly into the fake backgrounds. The photography was impressive, but the subject didn't look happy. The pictures in the apartment told a sad story, a blissful romance that had soured with time. Pictures were all of Graham's wife. If I was going to pass myself off as Graham, I needed to know all about him. His work, his social standing, and his health prior to his demise would be a good start. Perhaps I'd find more on his personal terminal. I needed to find out more information if I wanted to avoid getting caught out. Okay, ich laufe hier die ganze Zeit rum und guck mir die Sachen an und der will aber am persönlichen am per, äh, Terminal irgendwas finden. Naja, gucken wir mal. Guck mal, weil es meines uns verrät. So, Nachrichten. Ich konnte nicht access Grahams Messages. Ich habe das zu to meiner Liste von Dingen zu schauen. Keine Daten. City Life. Okay, navigieren. beenden. Oben gibt es noch Start. Ach, viel gebracht hat der Terminal aber nicht, muss ich sagen. The Council was made up of five ministries. Each ministry had their own logo and distinctive color scheme. From the color of his uniform, it was clear that Graham worked for the Ministry of Comfort. I wondered what exactly Graham's role was. chart showing that Graham's kudos score had recently dropped. I wondered what had caused such a sharp decline. I had made some headway, but I still needed to learn about Graham's work and his state of health. Aber wo kriege ich denn Informationen über die Gesundheit her? Kriege ich die hier auch? Weil, oder bekomme ich die hier auch? Weil das zeigt ja irgendwie nichts an, ne? Persönliche Daten.
persönlichen Daten sind leer. Gesundheit habe ich bis jetzt auch noch nichts rausgefunden. Mal schauen wir mal. Das ist jetzt hier der Schrank. Vielleicht haben wir noch eine Tür übersehen. Das Schlafzimmer können Sie jetzt ja noch mal versuchen. I knew Graham was low on kudos, but I still needed to learn about his work and his state of health. I needed to find out more information if I wanted to avoid getting caught out. Ah, alles klar. Hier könnte ich vielleicht ein bisschen was über die Gesundheit rausfinden. Meistens sind ja so die Medikamente im Badezimmer. A cleaning supervisor? I knew enough about Graham's status and profession. I wondered what his health was like before he died. After 10 years in the gap, I'd almost forgotten what a toilet looked like. Tempting, but I'd already had my monthly bath. Ich habe diesen Monat schon gebadet. Alter, heftig. Welcome back, Graham. Ah, Displaying your health chart now. It has been two weeks since your last checkup. You have lost weight. Congratulations. It has been noted that your height has increased. Adjusting records accordingly. Scanning for medical implants. Error. Implant missing. Refreshing biomodification database. Please wait. Na gut, dass dann nicht gleich Alarm geschlagen wird. Registration. Registering Schriebman port as new implant. The scanner had detected my Schriebman port. Which allowed me to interact with Link, the city's old network. Since then, I'd pretty much forgotten about it. Adjusting your health rating from C to A+. I was considerably fitter than Graham. That was good to know. Give me a checkup. Scanning. Your physical health is within the top percentile for a Union citizen. Where? Congratulations. Thanks. You are welcome, Citizen Graham. Do you have any advice for me? A single can of Spankles contains more than your daily dietary requirements. Look for the clown. Drink Spankles. Keep a smile on your face. Thanks. You are welcome, Citizen Graham. What devices do I have installed? You possess a U-chip personal data implant in the perlicue of your right hand. It is functioning correctly. Your cardiac regulator implants have been marked as removed. Please return them to your nearest medical waste facility. You possess a Schriebman local interneural connection port in the third cervical vertebrae. This hardware predates the Minos system and cannot be accessed at this terminal. That's probably for the best. You are welcome, Citizen Graham. Okay, then give That's all for now. Ich glaube, das müsste reichen. Alteration of your physical parameters, a new uniform has been ordered and will arrive at your home shortly. Keep a smile on your face. I was a lot healthier than Graham. In fact, I'd say Graham was downright unhealthy. I had learned all I was going to from Graham's apartment. I hoped it would be enough. Ja, das hoffe ich doch auch mal. Gucken, wie wir die jetzt hier im Schlafzimmer erwischen. If I was going to convince the mentor, I had to be sure I knew enough about Graham. Ja, äh, wir I couldn't keep gefunden. them waiting any longer. From that point on, I had to be Graham Grundy, cleaning supervisor. Darling, I thought you were going to freshen up. I was, but I missed the sweet sound of your voice. Oh, Graham, always the romantic. But please don't kiss me until you've showered. Wouldn't dream of it. Besides, I couldn't let Alfonso hear. Alonso? 
monopolize my lovely wife for a moment longer. In which case, shall we begin? Of course. Shall we take a seat in the lounge? Das ist schon arroganter So, Mr. Grundy. Mentor Alonso, what would you like to know? Ah, oh, well, straight to the point. I like that. As I was explaining to your dear wife earlier, there have been some issues with your activity records of late. Issues? What do you mean? Mr. Grundy, a word to the wise. This will be much smoother if you leave the questions to me. Now, whilst your records load, remind me in which ministry are you employed? Comfort. I'm a cleaning supervisor. Yes, of course. Ah, here we go. Graham Grundy, 42, cleaning supervisor with the Ministry of Comfort. Yeah. Cleaning supervisors require Class C exertive activity certification. I trust that your health rating is sufficient. Do go on, Mr. Grundy. Uh, C? Really? I put you higher than that. A, at least. So, with that in mind, I will mark you as fit for work, barring any other issues. So krass. Now, obviously, your kudos level will fluctuate um, due to your absence. You're a C plus right now. I note you used to be much higher. It isn't easy to keep up an A rating. A? I had you as B. Indeed, but it is aspiration day. <laughs> yes, of course. Clever. Well, that is all I need to check off. But I'd be remiss if I didn't offer you all the extra support and guidance that you need. Mentor? When someone goes off grid, there's usually some underlying trouble. And as a mentor, I like to think of myself as a bit of a troubleshooter. Of course. I appreciate the concern. So, let's get to the bottom of all this confusion. Dig a bit deeper, eh? Deeper? Yes, right. By all means, Mentor. Tell me about your workplace. I trust there are no issues. The land train facility. It's a fine place to work. I'm sure it is. Department of Land Trains and Extra City Commerce. Wonderful. Oh, yes. Couldn't be happier. We are, of course, very grateful for your service, Mr. Grundy. But there we come to the crux of the matter. Your absence. Fifteen days is a, a long time. This is, of course, why my ministry has become involved in your case. We have been concerned for your well-being. I'm fine. Better than ever, in fact. Excellent. Now, speaking of your health, I note you had some surgery last year. Tell me about your implants. Are they working effectively? You mean my heart regulators? Nothing to worry about. As you can see, the beat goes on. Yes. Well, I must say you're in remarkable shape considering your medical history. Of course, your mental well-being is just as important to us. How are you getting on with your <laughs> rather peculiar hobbies? You mean my photography? I do. Yes. You can't beat the feeling of an old time. I can imagine. You have an eye for composition. Although I don't understand your interest in using such archaic technology, gut, choosing to haben. fiddle with knobs rather than availing of ministry-recommended filters, stabilization, automatic archive, and data retrieval, oh, all courtesy lava, of lava, lava. If we can't später. see what you create, how can we share in your interests? What can I say? I like a challenge. I'm sure you do, Graham. Ah, well. 
I have a busy day of appointments, so oh, God, sadly no, we must conclude our side. little trap there. It's been a pleasure, Mentor. <laughs> Hasn't it? So with that in mind, perhaps you can tell me where you've been for the last two weeks. What? Right. Yes, where have I been the last two weeks? Well? Okay, so... the last two weeks. I was working at the land train facility, of course. Cleaning. I'm a cleaning supervisor. And while I was cleaning, I must have... bumped my head. The next thing I knew, I was in the middle of nowhere, still on the train. Two weeks later, the train returned to the city. Cleaner than it's ever been, I might add. My poor darling! How awful! What a dreadful thing to happen! What a I believe rush I from. have all the answers I need from you. Well, that's a relief. <laughs> I'm sure it is, Mr. Grundy. Well, thank you for stopping by. Uh, j just a teeny tiny thing before I go. There appears to be one or two anomalous results here. Anomalous? That doesn't sound good. <laughs> it may be nothing. But here's the thing. I get strange readings when I scan your U-chip. Any idea why? Mm, maybe it got damaged when I fell. Ah, yes. Of course. That's probably it. You see, the only other time I've seen anything like this is when a U-chip has been tampered with. No one would have done that now, would they? Tampered with? I didn't even know that you could do that. Graham's a supervisor, not a subversive mentor. Yes, a supervisor, not a subversive. Damaged when he fell. Request analysis. There. Perfect. I have everything I need. Great. Chipbot will show you out. Chipworth, darling? <laughs> Just my little joke. Chipworth. Good day, Mr. and Mrs. Grundy. Ja, so richtig glauben tut er uns das nicht. Mann, Mann, Mann. Ich weiß nicht, was wir mit Graham haben, aber ich glaube, wir können mit dem nicht mehr 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 nicht wissen? Who even are you? Ach, okay. Where's Graham? Hätte mich Are auch gewundert. Contact? He kept running about. Whatever Graham had been up to, it had gotten him killed. I had to come clean with his wife. There's no easy way to say this, but I'm afraid Graham is dead. What? How? Where? I found him. In the gap. The gap? What was the idiot doing in the gap? Was that where he was always sneaking off to? Ugh! A child, Milo, was abducted from a village out there and brought into Union City. And I think Graham was somehow connected. Sure. And pigs fly. Listen, stranger. I'm sure you can understand this has been a rather harrowing day. This is all too much for me right now. Tell me about it. So I'm going to do some damage control on social media. In the meantime, I guess that officially it is your home, so you can stay, but... This is my bedroom, and that one is yours. No cute ideas. Understood. Songbird seemed rattled by the news. Not surprising. But whoever this contact of Graham's was, I suspected they were the key to finding Milo. Küchensystem. Kann ich auch nichts machen. Kaffeemaschine. Ist auch alles in Ordnung. Roboter hatte keine Sicherheitslücke, der lässt sich aber wenig manipulieren. Okay, ich glaube aber in der Wohnung habe ich genug gesehen, ne? Ich 
I didn't think Songbird would appreciate me rummaging through her things. In Union City, even the teddy bears had screens. This one was broken. The shelf was loaded with books on management, business theory, and military strategy. I poked at it, but I couldn't get it to turn on. Ist der vielleicht hacken? Ne. Ist hier irgendwas hacken? Den Computer vielleicht? Ne. Jasmine. A detective calls. Someone liked their murder mysteries. A collection of toy animals were lined up in little baskets. One was missing. There was an empty spot marked Bartleby Bilby. I don't know and I don't care. Sagt sein zu dem Würstchen. I don't know and I don't care. Yeah. Reden? Songbird. I'm sorry. For what? That I pretended to be your husband. Listen, you did a better job pretending than he ever did. What do you mean? Look, stranger. You told me your secret. So I'll tell you mine. Last few years, Graham gave up trying to be anything other than the dullard he really was. If it weren't for the kudos for being married, I'd have dumped him months ago. You're new here, so a word of advice? You want to win in Union City? Learn the rules and play the game. My name's Foster, by the way. Robert Foster. Songbird. Is there anything more you can tell me about Graham? Not much. He was a loner. His only friends were idiots like him. Could Graham have had anything to do with kidnapping? For both our sakes, I hope not. Can I ask you about some missing children? I'd rather you didn't. Looks like Graham was quite the photographer. Oh, he was dreadful. At first I thought he was an artist. Then I found out he used those ridiculous antique cameras. It took hours to see the finished photographs. And he took forever fussing with the lighting. The only good thing about his photographs is that I'm in most of them. What do you know about the council? They run the city. You know, like they always have since Joey left. Can I speak to them? <laughs> Not with Graham's ID, you can. You work for the Ministry of Comfort? Sure do. It might not sound prestigious, but without us, the city falls down. You don't seem the type to settle for a cleaning job. Cleaning supervisor, thank you very much. And you'll find in Union City, it's not what you do, it's how you do it that counts. How so? You know, Get the job done, don't get in trouble, keep a smile on your face, the usual. Was ich gut finde, man kann die Fragen ähm, zweimal stellen und äh, die werden dann irgendwann ausgeblendet. What's with the Alonso guy? Gibt. Guy? I believe you're referring to Mentor Alonso from the Ministry of Wellbeing. He's a high-ranking official. And we've just lied straight to his face. Quite the team, huh? If he knew what's really going on, I dread to think how far my kudos would plummet. And what about me? Arrested, deported, I don't know, but not important. Is Alonso coming back here? For both our sakes, I hope not. But I'm not risking it, so don't even think about doing anything stupid. Nothing Alfonso, stupid? Ne? For how long? An name. Very amusing. Until my kudos is back on track, obviously. But for mm. now, you also, zu früh am are Graham. What can you tell me about the Minister for Comfort? 
The terminal has their details. Look there if you want to know more. What were you saying about kudos? Were you born yesterday? Let's just say I'm new here. Okay, newbie. Here's how it works in Union City. Be a good example, stay happy, and you get kudos. Which you... spend? Well, kinda, but not really. The higher your kudos level, the lower you are in the city. Simple. So kudos is... bad? Aren't you listening? Lower. Lower is better. So you need a higher kudos to get lower? Of course. That industrial pit up there hovers over me like a storm cloud. And this middle level is simply beneath me. I think I understand what you mean. But the lower level... Now, they are my kind of people. They've got standards that you don't see enough of around here. How can I raise my kudos level? With kudos, obviously. So how do I get more kudos? <coughs> das ist die Frage, wie werde ich hmm. reicher? Well, ich brauche question. mehr Geld, wie werde ich reicher? Like ja, I said, ja. be happy, get points. But how can you be happy when you've just found out your husband is dead? You think I'm not sad on the inside? No one's gonna give me a medal for having a dead husband. But... Let's talk about something else, eh? My points have already dipped way too much today, thanks to you. Tell me more about Graham. Why do you want to know? I think he might have been involved in something. What do you mean? I came to Union City from the Gap because I was investigating a mysterious... Oh, for Joey's sake, not you too. Blah, blah, conspiracy, blah, blah, giant dog. Graham was the perfect husband until he started getting crazy ideas. Why couldn't he just have an affair like a normal person? Graham was a conspiracy theorist? Always was. But before he went missing, he really changed. Oh, he became secretive. He used to close the terminal whenever I came into the room. That's not that strange. And he started spending a lot of time in the bathroom. And then he just disappeared. Okay, that's the weird bit. Who's this contact you mentioned? Bad news, as far as my kudos level is concerned. What do you mean? Graham was always rambling on about this hacker friend of his. Had a daft name. Leet, I think. Any idea where I could find Leet? Probably somewhere up top, with the other degenerates. Oh, no, if I were you, subject. I'd stay away. Oh, wie redet er? Did Leet believe in Graham's conspiracies? Believe? Pretty sure he's where Graham got him from. Bad influence all round. Are you a collector? What? Toys. You have quite the collection. Oh, yes. The whole set of cuddly kiddies. Even the limited edition Mama Bear from five years back. Well, I did have the whole set, at least. Did something happen? Bartleby went missing, that's what. I asked Graham about it and he denied all knowledge. Then, when I tried to use the Mama Bear tracker to find dear Bartleby, he threw her across the room. Clumsy. Clumsy? Those bears were my engagement gift. He hid Bartleby just to spite me. Graham had taken Songbird's toy Bilby, but I couldn't figure out what he'd have wanted with it. Wherever he'd gone, Graham clearly didn't want to be tracked. What does Bartley Bilby look like? Bartleby is a Bilby. Adorable, long ears. Like a bandicoot and a rabbit all rolled into one. At least he was, before he went missing. What's a mama bear tracker? What do you think? It tracks her babies. Her babies? The cuddly kiddies. Most oh. toys in Union City are tracker enabled. Lost toys mean screaming babies. Unless you got a tracker. Mind if I have a look at the tracker? Go ahead, though the screen is broken. Squeeze the left ear to turn it on. Mind if I have a look at the tracker? Go ahead, though the screen is broken. Squeeze the left ear to turn it on. Okay. Thanks. Yeah, bye. It looked like Graham had taken Bartleby and didn't want it tracked. I had a hunch that he had taken it to Leet, but had no idea why.
können wir den irgendwo reparieren. The device was now on, but with the screen broken, I need to find another way to get at the data. I wondered why Graham had taken a children's toy. Hello there. I'm Mama Bear. Hi. Mama Bear looks after all the cuddly kitties. Are you looking for one of my children? I'm looking for Bartleby Bilby. Don't worry, child. Look at my tummy to find your missing friend. den hier nicht austauschen, ne? Nö. Können auch die nicht austauschen miteinander. Ja, die so und so schon gar nicht. Das sind immer nur die Sachen, die wir... So, hier können wir zoomen und hier können wir... Hm. Das ist ja keine große Hilfe. Ich kann ihn nicht anders tracken, es funktioniert leider nicht. Okay, dann gehen wir mal zurück. The device was on, but the screen was still blank and broken. Don't touch that. Open windows. I can't even right now. I didn't think Songbird would appreciate me rummaging through her things. Ich finde mein Sand immer noch ein bisschen mehr Schuhe. You can tell a lot about a man from his shoes. In this case, that the man had no taste. Developing fluid in trays. I hadn't seen gear like this since I was a child. Vielleicht komme ich jetzt an seinen E-Mails ran. I couldn't access Graham's messages. I added that to my list of things to look into. irgendwie komisch, dass man am Drucker zugreifen kann. A cavalcade of cryptids. Ja, das ich auch Someone schon. believed in monster stories. Schauen wir mal, ob wir einfach äh, raus können aus dem Apartment. Und 
hat er das nur angezeigt. Ja, jetzt sind wir da. Aufzug. For a moment I was off balance. It felt like I was falling towards the building. But then I realized it wasn't real. Just a lifelike sculpture carved into the wall. What a relief. Okay, man kann auch die Treppe nehmen, das ist interessant. Someone had spilled paint on the floor. The hold all was stained with paint. Looked like someone planned on doing some painting. Jetzt mal ändern, mal gucken, was passiert. Da kann man nicht viel machen. No hand scanners. I figured they were intended for droids. Apologies, Citizen Graham. This is not your residence. Dann gehen wir mal raus. Das hat sich eben hier auch noch nicht erschlossen, was... Given your experience, your input here would be greatly appreciated. Das hat die Verrückte da oben, ne? Orana, isn't it? You strike me as a fine young officer of the Ministry of Wellbeing. Would you say that's an accurate description? I'm flattered, sir. Your record is exemplary, I believe. I do my best, sir. I'm sure you do. So please, don't let me down. Fix this mess. Mess? You mean the girl? The whole untidy situation. Yes, sir. At a girl? <laughs> Keep a smile on your face. After all, it's aspiration day, isn't it? The happiest day of the year. I'll take care of it, sir. I know you will. By the way, a call to pest control wouldn't go amiss. Of course, sir. Meanwhile, I shall isolate this area until this unfortunate incident has been resolved. Thank you, sir. I appreciate your advice. <laughs> We're all here to learn from each other. Take care now. <laughs> miss! Pardon me, miss! Kill me! <laughs> Hey! You can see forever up here! You know? Be free! Miss, you have to be careful! 
careful or care less? <laughs> I know which one I want to be. Why don't you come down, yes? Miss Dijon, is that right? Raquel Dijon. Yeah! <laughs> That's... me. I... I think... Raquel! Raquel? Did you say Raquel? You need to come down. What? Where am I? Oh no! Help! Well, I'm Help! Good Hearing her name had triggered a total change in the girl's behavior. I needed to find a way to get her down before she fell. Commencing spray. Please stand back. Water tank depleted. Send them all to me. From that height, the girl wouldn't fare much better than the can. Are you okay? No! I don't know how I got up here! Raquel! Raquel Dijon! Don't panic! I'm from the Ministry of Wellbeing! How can we help? Nothing to see here, sir. I suggest you go back inside and enjoy some screen-based entertainment. Excuse me? I'd like to make a complaint. Please, both of you. I'm a welfare officer. I know how to deal with this kind of problem. I just need to check the negotiation process. Yeah, es gibt keine Probleme genau. Das sind aber die geilsten Systeme. It's all very distracting. Das ist ja. How did you get up there? I don't know. Please, I'm frightened. She climbed the outside of the building. Astounding agility, by the way. Most impressive. I don't remember. Bravo, Miss. Sit tight. We'll soon have you down. Anyone got any ideas? Yes, I do. I have an idea. Go on. Never use a simile when a metaphor suggests itself. What? I'm in the middle of composing an Aspiration Day poem, but my lexiconic cupboard is bare, so to speak. Hence the requirement for... Wait, is this idea about your poem? Well, yes. You asked if anyone had an idea. You were not specific to the context. Can you see any way down from there? No! And everything's wet now thanks to that robot! Hold on. We'll work something out. Think you can get on the robot when it passes? I... I could try. But... but what if... We'll catch you. You can do it. I rather doubt she can. Can't you try and be more encouraging? You have a reasonably good eye for aesthetics! Thank you! Now, grab on tight. We'll be right underneath you. You'll be fine. Human grip strength is famously reliable. Only in short bursts. Oh, God. Okay, here goes. Ich muss ihn jetzt erstmal wieder sagen, dass er äh, ausputzen soll. Aber Werbung, Werbung, Werbung. Was hat Träger? Müssen wir mal austauschen hier. Er soll den Außenbereich wieder putzen. Manipulieren, okay. Hm. Okay, Freunde, ich würde sagen, wir machen an dieser Stelle erstmal Schluss. Es ist Sonntagmorgen, ich muss auch noch weg. Ähm, ja, wir sehen uns auf jeden Fall dann im dritten Teil. Das ist jetzt hier der zweite, den ich dann hochlade. Ja, schon sehr nice. Auch das Rätsel werden wir hier lösen. Also, das ist jetzt 
nichts, was man nicht schaffen könnte. Also von daher... Oh, jetzt kommt der Roboter, den ich ja gesagt habe, er soll endlich außen putzen. Vielleicht gucken wir uns das nochmal kurz an. Ich vermute mal, er wird jetzt nach oben fahren. Er dreht sich jetzt wirklich daran fest. Hat sie nicht getan. Okay, wie gesagt, wir machen jetzt hier erstmal Schluss. Ich bedanke mich erstmal für eure Aufmerksamkeit und dann freue ich mich schon auf den nächsten Teil. Bis dahin.